before we get into this, be sure to check out my Watch This First playlist. It is in the description box below, the first link there. And if you like it, I'd love if you consider subscribing. Anyway, let's get into this week. It's Sunday, December 15th. I cannot believe that Christmas is only 10 days away. And I just got back from church. My family is out going to grab something really fast. And so I thought I'd take this time to chat with you guys about what I'm gonna do today. Today, I did not edit last week. So I have to edit this vlog and hopefully get it up by about 5 p.m. tonight. And then my uncle's in town. So we are gonna go have dinner with him. And then I have a couple other things that I wanna do today. And you guys get to come with us in the spirit of Vlogmas. So I didn't eat before church. So I thought that before I start working on anything, it might be a good idea to feed myself so that I can actually be productive. I'm looking for my protein granola. Here it is. Okay, so I got my granola and now I'm gonna grab some yogurt and we're gonna make a nice little parfait. Going into this week, I really don't have anything planned yet. I have work two days because the kids that like are go to public school and stuff are still in school one more week. So tomorrow and Tuesday, we're going to watch my child. Wednesday, I go to my dad's office and work on an intern. Ooh. Ew. Wednesday, I go to my dad's office and work on an internship, which is always fun. And then I really want to go to Trader Joe's this week. So hopefully I will get to do that. They have so many like cute Christmassy things and I want to get like stocking stuffers and all that. So hopefully we can make it out there. Now that I have my food and everything, I'm going to hop onto my laptop and work for a couple of hours and then I'm going to check in with you guys after. Just popping on here to check in with you guys. We've edited about two and a half days of last week's vlog content, which is awesome. I'm watching it and realizing that last week was kind of a lame week, but like I tried my best with what I had. Wasn't a ton going on, but we can definitely do better than that. <laughs> some errands with my mom we ran to whole foods to pick up a few things and then ran to sprouts and like barnes and noble to get a christmas present for someone in my family and now i'm home and i have to finish editing the vlog from last week because i procrastinated tomorrow should be a little bit more fun i think i'm gonna try to finish up my christmas shopping and wrap some gifts maybe do some christmas baking i don't know i just want to do something christmasy anyways Oh, I have work. I have work. So we'll talk about that. So I changed it into my favorite sweatshirt and I decided that before I sit down and edit, I want to make some tea. <laughs> minutes ago my mom said that we're going on errands to go get my dad's secret santa gift for something at his work so we're gonna go grab my brother from school do that and then i'll check in with you guys so we just finished up at west elm we grabbed four mugs for my dad's co-worker and now i have the boys and we're going to apple going to Kilwins, which is Luke's favorite ice cream place. I have coffee and we're gonna take some pictures because our little brothers want to. Luke, are you my star? I am. from my errands we got all of our stuff done we went to west elm and then we went to the apple store where we returned some stuff at levi's and then we ran to kilwin's which is my brother's favorite ice cream shop so he was super excited about that and then we went to starbucks and trader joe's and at trader joe's my, one of my brothers is like super into giant candy this year i don't get it but he loves it and so for christmas he asked for like big candy so i saw this like giant chocolate christmas tree that you can like decorate and I, and I thought he'd like that so i grabbed that as part of his christmas present and i still have to find him a little something else but i'm closer to having all of his stuff done for christmas and having all my christmas shopping done which is awesome i think i'm gonna stop vlogging here for the day because just the rest of the day is me going to work good morning it's tuesday i was up way too late this morning until like 3 a.m and that is not okay and i cannot keep doing this but because of that 9 a.m was not sleeping in and i only got six hours of sleep so i'm out of it finally dragged myself out of bed after watching Chrissy Teigen in 73 questions on YouTube and now I'm gonna make some breakfast. I realized that I've only had oatmeal once in my life and I was 10 and I don't know what it tastes like so I got some yesterday and we're gonna try it together. So it says on the instructions, take off the lid. Okay, that doesn't look bad actually. There's peanut butter in there, chocolate chips, and it says to add a third of a cup of milk or water. I'm gonna do milk just because that's creamier. <laughs> One, I think I added too much milk. There's like, how do I show it without spilling it? See, it's kind of moving around. What if I stir it? Okay, let's give it a try. I like it. 
Okay, so it's a bit later now. I worked on some projects for a couple of hours and hung out with my brothers. If it's a little bit loud, they're upstairs playing right above us, so you might overhear them. But now we're gonna make some bento boxes. I like to meal prep. It just it makes it easier for me to stay on track and like eat the way that I wanna be eating if I have everything like preset for myself. So I'm gonna show you how I make my boxes today. For my lunch bento boxes, I like to have a meat, a cheese, a carb, and then some kind of fruit or vegetable. So yesterday I went shopping and I'll show you guys what I got for them. Okay, let's start off with fruit and veggies. I got some raspberries and blueberries to put in them this week. And then for veggies, I have carrots and snappies. This week for a meat, I love pepperoni. So I have like these little pepperonis from Applegate that just fit right in the little boxes. And then for my cheese, I just have like these cheddar cheese sticks that I cut up and put in there. Then for other proteins, I like to change it up so it's not like the same exact thing in each one. I have these peanut butter crackers from Whole Foods and I have just this jar of nuts. And then I have, I don't know what these are called, but they're like really crunchy. I guess they're just like a kind of cracker. I'm sure you know what they are and I just don't. And that's what we're working with this week. So first we're gonna wash these berries. <laughs> berries were soaking in the fruit and vegetable wash I started putting my proteins in the boxes and now I'm gonna put like a third of a cup of each of these berries into the boxes too okay so now that all of like my berries and my base protein is in there I'm gonna add in some crackers and the first two I'm putting four or five of these things and then in the second two I'm putting like a handful of these okay so now these two are finished and these need one more thing so we're adding snap peas okay I finished the first four and now I'm gonna throw together like two more with just some nuts peanut butter pretzels and snap peas I think <laughs> You can't see them all here because it's so tall. Each of them are under 300 calories and they have a ton of protein. So I like them to be about like half to three fourths of a meal. Something that if it was like paired with a smoothie or something with a little additional protein, it would be en enough to keep you full for like an afternoon. But if you eat it on its own enough for like a couple of hours. <laughs> Happy Wednesday. I didn't vlog that much today because it was a pretty boring morning. We went on some errands with them and now I'm here. And as much as I hate it, if you remember from last week, we're wrapping Christmas presents again. So I have four presents to wrap today. And this is a disclaimer for my family. If you don't want your presents spoiled, stop the video here, pause, zoom forward a few minutes, and your presents won't be spoiled. This is your warning. I got him this Ninjago spinner that he was asking for. For Luke, he loves The Office, so I got him The Office downsizing game. And then for my dad, we are huge Settlers of Catan players, so I got him Settlers of Catan Rise of the Incas. So that should be interesting. Let's get started. We have this nice dog wrapping paper that made an appearance last week. So we're just gonna do this. So we're putting the present on the paper and we're putting it face down so that at least the pretty paper is in the front. And we're gonna fold it over. And now we're adding some tape. And that was the end of that roll of paper. Please let me know how you guys feel about wrapping Christmas presents. Like, am I not the only one that hates it? Am I just problematic? Which I totally could be. I'm glad in school I never had to do one of those like present wrapping fundraisers. I think this week I'm gonna have you rate my gift wrapping, so. Here's the front. There's a little tear, so I had to cover it up. So the front's okay though. Ugly-ish. Well, actually it's not that bad. I would rate this gift wrapping job a 6.5 out of 10. Sorry, the setup's a bit different. My mom called me and needed me to go with her somewhere. So then I got sidetracked and had to put everything back together. And now I'm here and I and I just went ahead and finished my wrapping off camera, but I had to let you guys rate them because honestly, I think I got better. Because of that weird thing there, I'd rate this a five and a half. I'd give this one a five and a half, six. Okay, now on to today. So this was Drew's present. The front, I'd give this one a seven. It's not great, but it's not bad. Okay, here's where I really think I improved. Like, look at that. We got nice. We're giving this one a nine. And finally, again, this one, getting a nine. That's all I'm gonna vlog for today. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, guys. Happy Thursday. I literally just woke up. It's about 9.30. I'm gonna go say hi to the family, and then I'll come back up here and talk to you guys for a little bit. I had my coffee, and I talked to my family for a while. We had a good time, and now I'm up in my room. I need to clean it. I, it gets dirty every week. Like, this is just a part of the vlog that I have to have at this point in the week, so I'm gonna do that now. That's not super interesting for you guys, but... That's what I'm up to. Basically, I have a bunch of laundry that I have to do. So that's all in there. And then I have to 
put back all my craft stuff. I got it out because I brought the kid that I nanny stuff to make ornaments for his parents. So we're gonna take care of those things. And then I have some mugs like from my coffee cart that like, this is disgusting, but like I've just been keeping them in my room and, and they really need to be clean because I don't want them to get like moldy and gross and ruined. I don't know if that's too much information, but we're gonna do that. <sighs> I don't wanna clean this. If anyone wants to come clean my room, I'll pay you. I'm starting to get there with my room. I got a lot of just like the stuff picked up off the floor. I have a bunch of stuff that needs to be like moved back into the closet and I need to take all my dishes down. This I'm literally that person in those memes with like 10 mugs in their room because a lot of time my days consist of me sitting in my room drinking coffee. We also have like a bunch of cans of half-finished LaCroix. So I'm gonna take my mugs down, clean the ones that belong in here and then put the ones that belong in my kitchen down there. <laughs> Now we have to move on to what I've really been dreading today, my closet. As you can see, she's kind of a mess. We have like a pile of clothes. We have a gingerbread house box. We have uh, everything you could think of, shopping bags. And it really needs to be taken care of. So we're gonna get on to that. So I think I'm gonna start by trying to get all of my thousand and two sweatshirts back in order and then we'll go from there. I feel like this week we've improved. We've been a little less boring than last week because like I haven't been trying to film every second of every day. I've just been kind of trying to film the big stuff. Hopefully that improves the quality of this video. Tomorrow should be fun. Tomorrow, Rachel and I are going out. We're going to Target to finish up our Christmas shopping and then we're gonna get stuff to build gingerbread houses. So we have an extra. My mom did her gingerbread houses like a week ago. So we are gonna do that together and that should be really fun. It's her last day of her semester. So that's like a fun start to break. We invited Abigail to go with us, but we don't know if she's coming yet. I'm gonna turn this off while I finish picking up in here and I'll touch base with you guys in a bit. Good morning vlog. Today I'm hanging out with Rachel and Abigail. She's picking me up in like 45 minutes. So I'm gonna go eat some breakfast before she comes because I'm starving. I ran this morning and then I'll check with you guys in the car. A friend. <laughs> Ew, it's a bug. A Wait, friend. It might even disgust me. That's no. really gross. We should name it. Can we kill it? We should name it like. I oh killed the bird. I'm scared. So much. I think a bird fell from the sky or something. Like the print is dead now. <laughs> Ellie killed the friend and now it's suffering on the print doll. Oh my gosh, this is tragic. A picture. We're waiting for Rachel. And my, I'm so sweaty. And my eyes are peeling underneath. I'm so sweaty. Oh my gosh. I'm like the lighting's good though. My skin's discolored, but you know. Anyway, we're waiting for Rachel. Do you want me to roll a LaCroix? Yes, Abigail brought me a LaCroix. Fresh out the box. It's cold. It is. So we have that. We're feeling spontaneous. It's so spontaneous. Like very spontaneous. Like, to people, went to Chick Fil A, skirt skirted around town. We never do this. Anyway, we're waiting on Rachel, oh, yeah. and then we're gonna make a plan, and it's probably gonna end up back at my house at some point. Probably. We need to like. I should have brought the oh, turtle. turtle. I have a little. Turtle. There we go. Oh, my God, perfect. I have a little turtle on my dashboard. He's our perfect. little kickstand today. I didn't bring that with us because I didn't want to show up at Abby and be like, and we're vlogging. It's hot in Abigail's car. So hot. You're wearing like a wool sweater. <laughs> Can we tell them about? Um, it's Rachel! <laughs> oh, there we go. Wait, let me see your, the top of your head. What? Let me see the top of you your head. You have more hair than I do. See, I don't have any hair. That's the little issue. Do I have hair? No. You're really. bald. Like Matt, <laughs> we're both bald. I'm not bald yet. You look really good, Ellie. Thank, Thank you. You're welcome. Anyway. <gasps> that guy looks like my dad. <laughs> it's not. Well, <laughs> okay, it's like so. Hair. Does anyone have any Christmas shopping they need to do? Uh, I don't have anything for Tammy yet. Mm. And I have a hundred dollar budget. <gasps> That's I, I have one more present to get. <laughs> I had to go to somewhere to get Dan a gift card. So we've made it to Target. Oh, here it is. And we have to get Drew his Christmas present. Drew, this is your time to stop watching the video if you don't want to spoil it for yourself. He wants like this Ninjago spinner. Do you We're back from Target. We got Drew his present. Drew, you had your warning to stop watching. We're heading to Starbucks now to grab some drinks. Again, very spontaneous. We don't really know what's going on. There's no end game. No, not at all. We're just getting there. But I'm gonna get some sort of refresher. I'm gonna get a peppermint mocha. Okay, wait. So we bought Jingle Ball tickets an hour ago and we just like whipped down here. So we just made it to the venue. <laughs>
You know what? I have savings. I grabbed the tickets. And so we got the tickets and I called Abigail and Abigail initially was like, no, I can't. My mom's going to say no. But then she called me like two minutes later and she's like, I can go. And our floor seats were gone, but we got upper bowl. And then like 15 minutes into the concert, the security guard comes and he's like, hey, do you want to be moved to the floor? And so he gave us these tickets. We moved to the floor and we were in like the exact spot that we would have been if we got the floor seats. And yeah, so we had floor seats to the Jonas Brothers, Niall Horn, and Khalid for 25 bucks. It was a good night, and now I'm gonna go sleep for 12 hours. Abigail's gonna sleep for longer because she can. Wow, I'll touch base with you guys in the morning. Bye. Good morning, guys. I just woke up like an hour ago. I think it's like 10:30. Exhausted. If you watched yesterday's parts of the vlog, I went to a concert with Abigail super last minute. Niall Horan is like her Taylor Swift, and so I'm so happy she got to do that, and we got to be put on the floor. We got upgraded, and we got to have aisle seats, and it, it was just amazing. It was such a fun night. We've been saying that we were going to go to a concert together since like June, and I'm so happy that we finally followed through, but today we're back to reality. I'm going to print out some more pictures from my photo wall over there, because I haven't printed any since August, and a lot has happened since then, so I'm going to go finish my coffee, eat some breakfast, hopefully restore my photo library, my Mac's over there doing that. So I put on some clothes, put on some mascara, I'm not really trying to get fully together today, but now I'm going to go pick up my pictures, this from my wall. I forgot to tell you guys earlier, but I'm also babysitting tonight, and these are my favorite kids to watch. Yesterday, the little boy told my mom that he's so excited that I'm coming. I'm back from my errands, I really didn't vlog just because the opportunity didn't come up and it wasn't very interesting, but I thought I'd show you the prints that I got. So I got a dozen, my, my photo wall needs 11 to like get a new row. This is, I haven't updated these since New York. So this is my mom and I in Disney World in September. Me in Disney World, Luke and I in Disney World, and Abigail and I at Jingle Ball last night. Me at the Gummy Bear Factory. Me and my cousins doing face masks. Here's me at Magnolia. As you saw by that montage, I finished my photo wall and I made a snack, changed it into my comfy sweatshirt that I've worn way too many times on the vlog. And now I'm just gonna chill for an hour before I have to watch the kids. I just got up from my break before babysitting and I need to get ready to go now. And I'm gonna end the vlog here. If you made it to the end, thank you so much for hanging out with me this week. I hope you enjoyed the video. As always, my Instagram's linked down below, and I would love if you'd subscribe. I think there's a button here, and I'll see you next Sunday. Bye.